starting out with is my chunky or lug sole type style boots. Um, I am breaking this up into four categories. So it'd be like the com boot, combat or lug style boots. And then I have a couple of knee high boots. I have one pair of over the knee boots. And then I also have some kind of like sock booties or what you call booties. So what I'm gonna start out with first is the uh, lug sole boots. I'm gonna start out with these red ones that are sitting right here next to me. Um, these boots are in a size eight. They have a little chunky heel, a little track heel. They has the elastic um, on the side. And as you can see, it has this really cute uh, rhinestone um, detail here as like a strap. Um, it is detachable. So, I mean, if it's not something that you're interested in, don't be alarmed. It is something you could take off. But I really like that detail um, about this boot. But the great thing about it is versatile. So, it is something that you can take away. And I, um, just for reference, I do wear a size eight. So these are the shoes, the front, kind of like a rounded toe. And these are the shoes from the side. And these are the shoes in the bag. Probably like a two, two inch heel. Uh, not too bad. Not a shoe that you can't walk around in all day. These are some really cute red patent leather boots. And I did actually pick these shoes up from Shop Akira about a few months ago you know, when we were in quarantine and on lockdown, you know, a lot of us were doing a lot of online shopping. So that is one of the times I did pick up these boots. Uh, these boots are really, really cute. So this is the first pair of boots. So I'm gonna go through this rather quickly because I do have a lot of boots. I have a total of 11 I wanna share with you. And then I'm gonna also, in a cutaway, try each boot on so that way you can see how they look on. So this is the first pair. So the next pair of boots I'm gonna be showing to you. Um, I did actually feature these in my most recent Shein haul, which is these lug chunky type style boots in this kind of like sock like fabric. And it also has the chunky gold detail in the front. And this is the boots from the side. As you can see, it has that really cute ridging detail. And this is the bag. It pretty much looks like it's about the same size as the other boots I just showed you. But these are some really cute boots. And they are, I did try these all. They are very comfortable. I did walk around in them for a little while to see how they feel. Uh, these are some really cute boots. Um, I did pick these up from Shein. Again, uh, these are in a size eight, uh, which on Shein is like, I think it's equate to a size 39. So these are some really cute boots. Really stretchy, really comfortable, very nicely made. As you can see, these are those. Then the next style boots I'm gonna be showing you is my white chunky sole boots. It has a strap across the front. It ties up. I did pick up these shoes from Nasty Girl. Uh, these are actually still in stock, so I did uh, get a lot of requests from people about these boots. These are really cute boots. They are rather comfortable. They do come a bit oversized, so if you're not really comfortable with your feet or your shoe size, I mean, sometimes these shoes can be quite intimidating. So these boots are really chunky and big. I mean, when I first got them, I was like, oh my God, these shoes, ugh, I don't know how they're gonna fit. But I love these so much. I have styled up a lot of outfits on my Instagram. And again, if you guys are not following me on Instagram, please head over to my Instagram channel, which is my Instagram page, which is Contina Clark contina.clark and go ahead and follow me over there um i do post all of my style inspiration over there and i did style these up a lot of uh, different ways so these are really comfortable and these are one of my favorites and again i did get these from nasty girl nasty gal that is those these uh next boots is one of my most recent purchases which is the thick lug sole boots um it has the elastic band Kind of stretch material here and it's made in this faux leather thick wedge and as you can see this is the back these are some really nice boots i really really love these boots i actually saw another youtuber by the name of jada jonay she tried these on but i did already have my eyes on some boots these type of style um actually the ones that i saw on h m but they were constantly out of stock. I actually wanted the ones that were black with the brown sole. 
but I could never get my hands on them, but I'm glad I got my hands on these. These are really nice, as you can see. And these, these are not real leather. These are in the faux leather material. I have worn these and actually taken pictures in these. So these are some really cool, cute boots. So I really like these. That is those. So next I want to be showing you guys is my knee high style boots. So I'm going to go ahead and get into that for you right now. Like I did mention you guys, I'm going to go ahead next and start out with the knee high boots. The first pair of boots I'm going to show to you, I did get these boots from Fashion Nova. These are some really unique boots. And again, all of my boots and shoe sizes are in a size 8. And if it is a different size, I will let you know. Um, first, I'm going to start out with these cutout pointed toe heel. Probably about 4, four inch heel. I'm not 100% sure, but I'll let you know down in the description. These boots are some really cool boots. I did um, see these on the Fashion Nova website over the uh, holidays. And they did also have these boots in a cognac brown. I was kind of going back and forth. Should I get black? Should I get brown? But I decided to go with the black. Um, these are some really cute boots, as you could tell. These are different. They come in this weave pattern, cutout type material, which is one of the fashion trends uh, for the summer. So you can really come up with some really cool looks with these boots. So these are my first knee-high boots. Um, pair of knee-high boots that I did get that are in like a high heel. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and show you my cowgirl inspired boots. I did pick up these boots from Shein. These have a snack boss print, black faux leather, and it also has the buckle around the ankle. And this is the top of the boot. This is the front. This is the side. And this is the bag. These are some really, really nice boots. I really love these boots. These boots. I can't wait to wear them out. Um, right now, working from home. So, you know, your girl has been struggling. My um, fashion sense has kind of changed a little bit. But, you know, you still have those things that you like what you like. So, again, every chance I get, when I do get, you know, get ready to go out, I'm definitely pulling these out. They are so comfortable. They're easy to style up. You could wear, you know, your faux leather shorts with these. You can also wear some leggings, faux leather pants or tights. These are some really nice boots and you can pretty much dress these up in a lot of different ways. You go wear them with some knit, knit dresses. These are some really cute boots. I did also style these boots up on my Instagram. So if you're not following me over on Instagram, please, you know, once you're done watching this video, head over to my Instagram and follow me at Contina.Clark. So that way you can see a lot of these things that I am showing you here on my YouTube. You'll see how I did style these things up which will give you a little bit of inspiration. So that is those. And next, I'm going to also show you, this is the last pair of my knee-high boots that is in my collection. I actually have a couple more, but these are some of the most recent things that I have bought um, this year. Next is these satin light uh, material boots. I did get these from Fashion Nova. These are some wedge-style boots. Um, and again, they are knee-high. They are in this black satin soft nice material has a pointy toe and as you can see it has a wedge i really really love these boots they are so comfortable i have worn these boots with so many different things i mean i haven't really been out that much but when i have gone out to some special places i do wear these boots and they are very comfortable and i also have taken some pictures too in these boots over on my instagram so again don't forget to go over there and again, these boots, they do have an inside zipper to help you get in and out really easy. So these are some really good, great boots. And that is that. Okay, so lastly, um, what I'm going to be showing to you is some sock boots um, that I did pick up. I think I got about four of those and then I'm going to pair of knee-high boots. So I'm going to go ahead and get those for you. Next, I'm going to be showing you guys my sock booties. I do have a total of three pair of sock boots that I did pick up, or booties I did pick up over the past few months. And I'm going to go ahead and start out with the first pair, which is from Shein. This is a nice brown, chocolate brown. Everybody know that chocolate brown is one of the popular colors of the season. So I did go with these brown chocolate knit sock type booties. They have this brown heel. Uh, you can see the pointed toe. These boots are really comfortable. I can't wait to wear these. 
I'm going to actually try all of these boots on so that way you guys can kind of get an idea of how they look on. So I will be doing that um, in a little cutaway. So each boot that I do show you, I'll be showing you up in a cutaway on how I did on how they all uh, fit. So I will be actually showing you guys. So these are those. Next, I'm going to also show you um, another sock style type boot, which is in this beautiful Kelly green color. It has a pointy toe. And look at that heel, you guys. These have a really cool heel. They're not, I mean, they're not as comfortable, but they're not that bad. They're not unbearable. But they're really good. And as you can see, they come in this really soft material in this color Kelly Green, which is another popular color of the season. Look at that heel. As you can see, I have worn these a little bit. I really like these shoes. Um, and again, I did get these from Fashion Nova. So these are some really really cute cute boots so these are those and lastly when it comes to booties um i did get this snake print style boot in this pretty nude and brown color it has this pointy toe it has a really cute heel and as you guys can see this boot has a really really high arch it has the shoe strings on um, where you tie them up I really, really like the style of these boots, but one thing I can say, one of the cons, other than the fact that they look really nice, they're really cute, they are very, very uncomfortable. These are the type of boots that you're gonna wear where you're gonna walk to the car, walk probably about two minutes to the restaurant, you sit in, just a little cute, because these boots here are very uncomfortable. I, I don't know, maybe it, I haven't really worn here heels too much over the past year or so, do the quarantine but i find these are the most uncomfortable but they are really cute so these are those i think it's just the arch the way that it's made it doesn't really give your feet like the support that it needs so these are very, very uncomfortable but i still really do like these boots so these are one of the last booty styles and then last but not least is these over the knee boots i did also get these from fashion nova they're in this like cowboy type style. It has a lot of different prints. It has the zebra print, it has the snake print, it has the leopard print. So it has a lot of great cool colors. It's pointy toe. These are some really cute boots. I did actually style these up also on my Instagram. So what I'm gonna do is put up some pictures of the ones that I did style already. So that way you could kind of have an idea on how to wear these type of shoes. Uh, these are over the knee. I am 5'3". I did find it was kind of awkward because i am so short that they really did come up really really high so they were kind of a bit overwhelming but i do still feel like i was able to style these up and manage to work with them um again when you're not really that tall over the knee boots can't be a really good fit for you some of the times because of your height but i did get a good wear out of these and they're very comfortable i should say these are very comfortable and as you can see let me give you a close-up all the different little patterns it has the leopard print snake and zebra print so you can pretty much style these boots up a lot of different ways and again they're very comfortable so that is that that is actually the last pair of boots um in my collection again i have a few more other boots um i didn't feature those i did want to just show you guys the ones that i did pick up most recently and again i did enjoy making this video for you guys don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to comment. Don't forget to like, leave some type of comment. So again, so that YouTube will know that I am here um, making this content for you guys. I plan on being consistent. So that way every week you're going to get at least two videos. So again, don't forget to comment. Don't forget to like, and also don't forget to subscribe. So that way you'll be a part of the family over here. And also don't forget to hit that notification bell. That notification bell is going to let you know Every time I have a video upload, you'll be made aware that Contina has a video today. So don't forget to hit that notification bell so you never miss a video. And thank you guys so much for watching. Again, have a great day. Goodbye.